Toledo School. In 1085, Alfonso VI of Leon and Castile captured Toledo and established direct personal control over the Moorish city, ending the medieval Tafas Kingdom of Toledo, from which he had been exacting tribute. After the conquest, Toledo's Arab libraries were not pillaged, and a translation center was established in which books in Arabic or Hebrew would be translated into Castilian by Muslim and Jewish scholars, and from Castilian into Latin by Castilian scholars, thus letting long-lost knowledge spread through Christian Europe again. The Toledo School of Translators is the group of scholars who worked together in Toledo during the 12th and 13th centuries, to translate many of the philosophical and scientific works from classical Arabic. The first phase of the school was led by Raymond of Toledo, the Archbishop of Toledo from 1125 to 1152, who started the first translation efforts at the library of the Cathedral of Toledo, where he led a team of translators who included Arabic and Jewish scholars, and monks from the Order of Cluny. Another important translator was John of Seville, a baptized Jew. Together with Dominicus Gundisalinus during the early days of the school, he was the main translator from Arabic into Castilian. John of Seville translated Secretum Secret Orum, which was very influential in Europe during the High Middle Ages. He also translated many astrology treatises from Abu Mashir, al kindi and the Sabian mathematician Thabit ibn Kura. John of Seville produced Latin translations of Ibn Sina, Al-Farabi, Al-Ghazali, and Ibn Gabaral. Known to the West as Abi Spran, Ibn Gabaral was an important Jewish Neoplatonist. With him, the center of Jewish philosophy shifted to Spain, including Abraham Ibn Dud's defense of the rabbinical tradition according to Aristotelian philosophy, Judah Halevi's attack on philosophy, and Moses Maimonides' great combination of Judaism and medieval Aristotelianism, secured the place of philosophy as a legitimate aspect of rabbinical study. Dominicus Gundisalinus, c. 1115, post-1190, is considered to be the first appointed director of the Toledo School of Translators, beginning in 1180. Gundisalinus remained collaborating with Abraham Ibn Dud the author of the Sefer H. A. Kabbalah which reported of Rabbi Makir's exile and Johannes Hispanus to the realization of around 20 translations of Arabic works into Latin. Among Gundisalinus' important translations was Fons Vitae, by Ibn Gabriel.